With 86% of under 25 Brits wanting to rejoin the EU, I've been traveling around the European Union asking people what they think about Brexit and Britain rejoining. In my last two videos, I was in France and Germany. I'm now in Spain. What did you think about Brexit? So, I think also things that in Britain, uh, there was a slightly lack of political culture and people um, lack, were lacking confidence uh, about um, politicians and they were fooled by populism. So, um, my opinion about the Brexit is a... Uh, it's a terrible mistake for the British people. No? Well, to be honest, I think it's a it was really, really bad idea. He believes that uh, British feels like they are detached from the rest of the world and they want to be their own country. But then, when Ireland, when Ireland was asking the same, they wanted to be independent, they went there with soldiers and they didn't allow them to be independent. So, he said, like, uh, maybe something not really nice that you are like a little bit arrogant. Well, I, I don't agree with, with it. I think it's better for UK to be in Europe, uh, for the economy, uh, also the tourists and people who travel, especially from Europe. And I don't see a benefit in, in Brexit. The person in front of you is from Bosnia, not Spain. And the reason I've kept him in is because he's lived a number of years in the EU, in Spain. But also, he's got a unique perspective. Bosnia is outside the EU. So what's it like coming from a third country? I'm from Bosnia and uh, we don't have that opportunity to, like, to leave the country freely, not to leave the country freely, to go, to travel around the Europe. We can, but we can't stay, for example, like the the, uh, the British people, they, they could come to Barcelona and live their life without asking any visa, any permit, without asking for the papers. And for, for example, for me, it was way more difficult uh, to find a job, to get the contract, to stay here. So. I don't know, honestly, I don't think, I don't think it was a really good idea for them to left the European Union to, to Brexit. How, how did you feel when the UK left? He was very disappointed. He thought the UK will be more politically aware and they will understand that they were, were being fooled in this moment. Okay. Most, people, most of British people, they, they, his decision was uh, they don't want the European community, so it was his decision, his decision, so. One percent difference. So it was only by one percent. So it's 500,000 votes just to leave. That's it. If it had gone the other way, it, we could have ended up staying, but it was very close. I know. 60% want to now rejoin, 67% as I a, know that, but if you want to choose a president, mm -hmm. if you want the one percent wants the right side, mm. and the other side wants the, it's, it's the same. You felt like you were like superior, you were higher to the others, but then now your your currency is going down, and so you see this was, this was a big mistake. Además, siendo los primeros que no metes en la comunidad. Yeah, and then you, you are the ones that wanted to be in a community before, and now you don't want to do it anymore? You are leaving us alone? I would say it was a surprise. Also, a, a, a slow cooking surprise, so to speak, right? Because, uh, we got, in a way, we got used to have uh, uh, Great Britain in, so to speak. And because, especially for Spanish, uh, Spaniards of my generation, uh, we had a very, a very positive uh, look on what uh, the European Union was, right? So it was a place where you had democracy and you have a better standards of living. And for Spaniards, it was a big change to be there. So we thought that just leaving that uh, was a bad thing, <laughs> both for the British and for, our, and for the whole of the Union. So if this was good for your economy, then you did well. But in case your economy went wrong, you should step back from this choice. The economy's gone down. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it's very difficult for one only one country to have their own economy without having a relationship with the other countries. They used to have that opportunity what English people had, you know, like I think they don't it's not that they don't know, it's just like it 
it's not they're thinking about uh, the other countries that are not in Europe Union you know how hard is for for those people from those country to live in those country to I would say to escape to get away with those countries because there's not uh, jobs or like uh, good life and they had it well they had it all until until they left the Brexit for the next round we asked people if they'd have the UK back in France, seven people said yes, no one said no. In Germany, 12 said yes, and one said no, giving you a total of 19 yes and one no. What are they going to say in Spain? ¿Qué pensaría si que tienes una opinión sobre el hecho que ellos pudieran volver? volver. So what, what uh, you had to do is not go away because now you made some problems in all Europe about the economy. We couldn't have uh, uh, ex we can exchange products anymore uh, like the way we used to do because now all the prices are higher. Okay, so if you want to come back, it will be very keen because everybody is right to make a mistake. Bienvenidos. Bienvenidos. Welcome back supuesto. if you want. I must sell the through. Mm -hmm. Go away. Don't come back. The UK wanted to rejoin. Which, how would you feel about that? So yes, we will agree on UK coming back, but with the condition that they will accept to be part of the Eurozone, because unity means unity also in, in economy. In economy. Okay, welcome back. <laughs> I think it would be great, yes? Yes, I think it's the same. I don't know, like if it's possible, <laughs> if I if I could choose, I would choose to, for sure, to, to get back to European, Union, like, for sure. I don't know. So she will be open to have a UK coming back if this means that the life of people from this Four country in UK will, will do better, will, will improve. Uh, what we can't allow for uh, a bad political choice to um, ruin the life of people. An overwhelming victory for rejoin, despite what lots of people are saying on social media, including plenty of trolls who seem to think that this is fake. If you want to prove me wrong, do your own video. Do you have a message for the UK? Hopes and strength. Oh. In the EU, it's better for you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so, despite all those warm messages, I didn't feel the warmth I'd actually felt in France, which was actually quite surprising. The French seemed to consider us to be family, whereas with the Spanish, it seemed more like it benefits everyone to be together. I'm still not going to reveal what was in the boxes. I'm going to save that for a later video. And coming up, Italy next. And once again, thank you to all my Patreon and YouTube supporters who keep this channel going and growing. If you'd like to become a member, click on the link in the description, or you could just leave a comment about the video. You can click that like button. It's all for free and it helps the channel grow.